Hello, I'm Iznane and in this video I would like to show you how to get mouse input from user and again move a circle around the screen, this time it will be a little bit different. We'll use code from the previous episode, the keyboard input one. First thing we'll do, since we won't use keys anymore but mouse buttons, let's change keyboard key to the mouse button. Next I'll also change the title. The last thing to do would be changing this code to handle mouse input instead of keyboard input. First let's do something if we'll hold a left mouse button. We'll use function is mouse button down with mouse left button. Now let's change the ball position so it will move towards the mouse position using lerp function. Lerp stands for linear interpolation and in this case this function will take a vector 2 and a float value. So we would like to lerp towards the mouse position and let's send the value or amount to be something small, so it's not moving very fast. Now let's make something happen on right button press. Let's just directly change ball position to the mouse position. And similarly to previous episode, let's change the ball's color. Well, it's time to try it out. So we have our ball. Let's see what happens if we'll hold left mouse button. And as you can see, it's lurping towards the mouse position. Well, you probably can't see my cursor, but if it's far away, it will go fast and the cursor is closer to a ball, it will move slowly. So yeah, that's how lurping works. Let's also try the right mouse button. Yeah, it will change color and just jump right into this. So, thank you for watching and I hope to see you in the next videos. Bye!